Hi and welcome to the uh, next video in our um, series of uh, YouTube videos uh, related to the Sage 200C product. Um, this one is related to the um, new updates etc related to making tax digital. Okay, As you can see on there, um, from um, April next year, so April 2019, all companies who are VAT registered will be required to use the new HMRC portal for uploading VAT returns and basically it has to be done electronically is based on the current guidance. Okay, um, In order to do that then you may well require an update to your Sage 200 system. Um, the only version um, which supports um, this new uh, the new Making Tax Digital portal is the very latest version now which is the Sage 200C uh, with the Spring 2018 enhancements. Um, that comes up in your software as 12.00.0013. So I'll just show you how you can find out which version you're running. So click in the software, click the little cog in the tools and click about Sage 200. Okay so this version is 12.00.0013. Any that are earlier than that will not be supported for making tax digital so you will be requiring to get an upgrade to your Sage system um, for that. Okay, I'll just click OK. Um, the other settings that are applicable to this uh, are found in the nominal ledger. So go to nominal ledger, utilities, ledger setup and then ledger settings. Okay, so we want to do an online VAT submission. We click onto this and go to the VAT submissions tab. Um, we have to tick enable online VAT submissions. Now say against our test system we've currently got it disabled for making tax digital but basically that will then become active or, or enabled um, and then basically it means what it will do, it will do an online VAT submission using the new making tax digital portal. Sage are just finalising that and I say they have a pilot scheme that's been running for a while now. Um, that will then be finally rolled out um, fully live uh, in advance of April 2019. So that's the that, that's where basically you can tell if you're doing it. So say you check your version uh, and then you're running um, and I say then when that says enabled that means it will actually then communicate when you run your VAT return which you do from your nomin ledger, period end routines, VAT analysis. Just click into there, go into current period return and when I click produce VAT return that will produce the VAT return and would also then connect up to HMRC's portal and as I say it only goes to the new making text digital if the bits are all set up you the correct version and it's enabled on there. Okay, that, uh, That's about all there is on this video so it was just really just to keep you informed and updated uh, with regards to the new making tax digital changes so say all businesses uh, in the UK who are VAT registered from April 2019 will be required to submit their VAT return online electronically. That concludes this video. Thank you very much.